The metaverse, which some people are calling part of Web3, can be challenging to explain since one does not exist yet. However, people have presented their visions for it. You can think of the metaverse as an immersive 3D and communal virtual universe. Users will be transported into the virtual world, similar to how users are transported into a virtual reality video game. Currently, the most agreed upon method of accessing the virtual universe is through VR headsets. In the future, technologists hope that VR headsets will not be needed to access the metaverse, but for now, they're the most promising method. When thinking about the metaverse, it can be helpful to think of virtual reality as the vessel and the actual metaverse as the destination. Furthermore, when in the metaverse, users can do significantly more than play games, which is the dominant use case for virtual reality. Users will be able to socialize with other humans around the globe, shop, conduct business, and more. Additionally, the metaverse will incorporate cryptocurrency so users can pay for goods and services while in the virtual world. NFTs are frequently regarded as a form of digital art. However, in the metaverse, NFTs can represent land. In any particular metaverse, there should be a finite amount of land created to create scarcity. Scarcity increases the value per the law of supply and demand. So just as an individual in the real world would buy a deed to a plot of land, users in the metaverse will be able to purchase land in the form of an NFT. There is already land being sold as NFTs in the virtual world. For example, Republic Realm, a digital real estate investment company, bought land in the central land for $913,000 in the form of an NFT. The central land is an Ethereum-based virtual reality platform. The key players in the race to build a metaverse include tech giants such as Facebook, Microsoft, Amazon, and Snapchat. Additionally, there are large companies that are not considered household names yet, but are also investing heavily in the metaverse, such as NVIDIA and Roblox. NVIDIA is known for creating computer graphic processors and chipsets used in automobiles and robotics and is investing heavily in artificial intelligence. On the other hand, Roblox is an online gaming software where users can share games that they develop and create. Both companies are major players in the gaming sphere, so it does not come as a surprise that they are both involved in the metaverse trend. The metaverse is a massive undertaking that consumers might not experience for decades to come. As companies grapple with transforming their visions for these worlds into reality, virtual reality continues to be a key factor in the process. Who knows, by the time the metaverse is ready for consumer adoption, new technologies could emerge that replace the need for virtual reality. Only time will tell. For more updates and news on tech trends and emerging technologies, be sure to follow us on Twitter, LinkedIn, and YouTube. If you have any questions or want additional information, email us at info at quantalist.com or visit our website at www.quantalist.com.